Hi, Grimace. Where are you going? Just going to soak up a little sun. Well, while you're soaking up a little sun, we'll soak up some McDonald's frosty thick shakes. Dum, dum, dee, to the beach, da, to the beach, da, 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 da. Oh, 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 this is good. Oh, oh, hot. Oh, oh, boy, it's hot. Oh, oh. all dried out. Oh, my toasty. Quick, let's get him to McDonald's. McDonald's frosty thick shakes ought to refresh him. How about another chocolate strawberry and vanilla shake? Well, I certainly hope you learned something from this, Grimace. Oh, I certainly have. Next time, I'll sunbathe closer to McDonald's and McDonald's frosty thick shakes. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Holy crap, it's 121. Okay. Quick 10 minute break. Mm. Oh, yes. There they are. The perfect specimen to be my host. The mortal form I can use to awaken and lead all my followers who have consumed my birthday milkshake. My plan will finally come to fruition after all these years of that damned clown always chiding me, treating me like a child. I'll make Ronald pay for taking my arms, brainwashing me into being a marketable character for his television show. I'll be the one brainwashing now, Ron. I'll take your franchise from you. You'll have nothing. You will rule the day, Ronald. Now, how do I hypnotize this person to make them want to drink my milkshake? Uh, hello? I am brainwashing you. The, uh, milk, the milkshake, you, are make drink the McDonald's, Grimace, birthday, milkshake, egg at McDonald's. Yeah, that'll, that'll work. Okay, so. Before the whole Grimace milkshake trend started, I heard about the Grimace meal. I was like, I want to try that. I think Grimace is endearing enough as a character. I'll get the the Big Mac and the, the, the milkshake. I don't even like McDonald's. This is marketing working on me. I'm sorry. But then the whole trend happened, and everyone started pretending that they were dying after they drank the milkshake. And I'm just confused. But here we are. I'm going to McDonald's with all my friends, and then we're going to drink the milkshake. Hi, I've decided to maybe, because it's like a trend, just like a good food review. What do you think? A what? A, a food review. A of what? Of the Grimace meal. This might be your last video. <laughs> like, here's the thing. McDonald's milkshake. I've never drank, in, drank one. And not gotten immediate bowel problems afterwards. It could actually just kill me. Benny might be fine. He could pretend to die for the trend, but for me, I might be the only one to legitimately die. <laughs> it just explodes my ass. You know that's like. This footage only works if the vlog works out, otherwise it all gets deleted. We're having the most difficult time trying to figure out if this location has a good one. And this is the stupidest thing ever because I feel very stupid every single time I say the words Grimace Meal out loud, Benny. Do you understand? You do this every time I put a camera in front of you. I don't know. <laughs> We're going to check it on the, ki the kiosk, and if it's gone, it's gone. We're in the Act 2 twist, where like things go horribly, horribly wrong. And you have to see if we pull through. Because I don't think there's going to be an Act 2 uh, comeback. An untwist, if you will. An untwist. Don't... They're mocking us. Like, I'm gonna be completely rude with you. The cashier was so slow. Like, I handed him the $21 for the $20.54 order. And he went, he was like, oh no, this, hold on. Yeah, you should be both at the same moment. We got the deluxe quarter pounder. We got some fries. We got, that looks so sad, man. Why is McDonald's like this? French fries. We got some sweet tea. A paper straw. Oh, fuck. So you recommend that we... The evil Grimace had grabbed all the cups. Where's the Coke? Where are the shakes? Thinking quickly, Ronald disguised himself as a mailman and... A special delivery for E. Grimace. Ooh! Oh! Oh, my! Ah, I've been picked for the McDonald's Land Beauty Contest!
hast discovered it lives. Hi, sorry for being incredibly washed out. There's a white computer screen in front of me, so that's bound to happen. But I realized you could order this online. Like, that is a thing I could have done this whole time. So we're gonna select a large with french fries and the birthday shake. And I'm going to enjoy it. Proceed to checkout. And I need to make an account. So now that that's all finished, I have the issue of... I've had this whole saga with getting a new debit card because of the previous one had issues that blah, blah 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 and I just got one but I have misplaced it somewhere in this house and I forgot about it is it in my laundry it is what's that? it's it's right here oh 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 what's that is it, is it, it's a debit card uh, oh hang tight McDonald's is working on your order it's July 1st Grimace's birthday was what like the 12th which means it's been 14 16 17 days does this purple chicken nugget really deserve such a long birthday celebration anyway it's supposed to be coming in about half an hour but I am starving so it's been like an hour since I ordered it because I, I've set it for delivery at 11.30. McDonald's has the breakfast menu that ends at 11. So then you have to wait till after 11 in order. Like if you want to have something directly at 11, it turns out you can only get beverages on the delivery app. So I haven't had breakfast. I just got notified that the order was canceled. Okay, so it should be coming in between 11.50 and 12. It is now 11.36. Six minutes after it was supposed to initially have come out. And they're like, actually, this doesn't work anyway. I was expecting it to say like, oh yes, this location is out of stock. But no, they said your card is the problem, which is not true because I just placed another order. And it says it's going to deliver to me. Hold on, you guys can see my, my little car. Transformer. Turn into robot, but look like co- Taking his nicest swimsuit, off he went. Now let's get these cups back to McDonald's. So we can have some triple thick shakes and icy cold Coca-Cola. Uh, I'm ready. I'm ready. Where's the contest? McDonald's land by McDonald's. Okay, they just rang my, uh, the buzzer. That's what it's called. I'm just gonna stand here and, and wait. Respectfully. Here's some walking door. My face is getting absolutely squished. It's, it looks longer than that in real life. I'm getting real squared off. It's so stupid. Okay, this bag. I need you to look at the tape. This is an absolute travesty because like this is supposed to be taped and this is supposed to be taped, but this isn't never connected. And this also disconnected. So, well, that certainly smells like McDonald's. Uh, well, here's the Grimace's birthday. Here's the milkshake. Oh God. You've got our fries. Yeah, they taste like french fries. Here is the Grimace Birthday Big Mac. Ugh. Okay. Ugh. It's falling apart. I haven't had breakfast. This is my breakfast. So my body's like, oh, thank goodness. We have food in our system. God, this feels so good. It tastes like crap. So here's the milkshake. The whipped cream has melted, which is great. But uh, as I've told you before, every single time I've had a McDonald's milkshake, I've had diarrhea. That is certainly vanilla ice cream with a hint of berry. There's not a lot of berry. It does taste just purely like vanilla ice cream with like a LaCroix amount of berry. Like my friend Ellie told me they had this and was like, oh yeah, it just tastes like vanilla ice cream. I think it's just purple food dye. If you reread the text, Elsa actually says that it is apparently just vanilla ice cream and a milkshake, which means that they had heard that it was just vanilla ice cream and then believed that it was just vanilla ice cream. But if you look at this new text from a couple minutes after I recorded that clip, they tasted something else besides the vanilla ice cream that was very prominent that made it taste bad to them. Which means they believed it was just vanilla ice cream despite tasting something besides vanilla ice cream. Which makes you think, do they think that the food dye was the issue? That food dye has flavor now? But that's what it makes you think. See, I hate McDonald's milkshakes. They always leave a weird burning aftertaste in the back of my throat. So maybe they just drank this milkshake, tasted a little something off, and it was like, yeah, that's just what McDonald's milkshakes are like. Maybe I'm gaslighting myself, who knows? No, there is a little bit of a sweet aftertaste that isn't there in vanilla. One of the worst purchases I've ever made in my life is McDonald's delivery. Look how sad this is. This is the face of the number one food chain in America. And I contributed to that today. And I don't know how I feel about it. All because I wanted to help that little purple chicken nugget man have a happy birthday. I ate too much food without any drink. So another sip. Yeah, no, there is, there is definitely some bad. My stomach is actually upset right now. Like, I can feel it being like, ooh, I didn't like drinking that. I do have lactose intolerance. You're gonna be like, oh, so it's probably just that. No, no, it isn't. I love this logo. I love the font and the little crookedness of it. And goodness gracious, my stomach hates me right now. My lactose intolerance is very thin. I've had ice cream. I've had pizza. I've had all kinds of dairy. My stomach doesn't care. And then sometimes, out of the blue, be like, okay, this piece of dairy, though, this is the kicker. And consistently, it's always been the McDonald's milkshake that's been the kicker. <laughs> Ugh. I feel like I just emptied out my entire ins. Duh. 
I finally done it. I <coughs> I have finally done it. I'm corporeal. I will finally be able to summon my legion. Use all that have consumed my milkshake for my whims. My whimsies. My wants. Oh, Ronald, you have no idea what's coming to you. I am going to lead an army against you, Ronald. I will tear you limb from limb from limb. This might help to me, Ronald. <laughs> Like I'm immune to possession and stuff. What? Right. I really the toilet. That's what. Well, okay. No, that's fine. I didn't think my bowels were the way to possess me. Am I really? Good? I didn't even drop my glasses. These look good, right? Okay. The good stuff. That's fine. No, that's fine. No, we're good. I gotta clear my eye, I gotta get some motion. After I told my friend Ellie that I was making this video, they told me to show you this picture of them crying after watching too many animations of Grimace being sad about people dying after drinking his milkshake. And I, like, do you think it was going to be a big surprise you were crying? You watched a bunch of sad stuff, and then you got sad. That's why you were crying. Did you get hit with a stupid disease? What the fuck? I'm going to be so real with you right now. It is 7.36. I've used the toilet at least seven times since I drank that milkshake. And I, I, I drank it once immediately after I drank the milkshake, right? I told you my stomach hurt. I used it right after I finished the milkshake. Then like maybe two, three hours passed. Then I used it again. And then they've been getting closer and closer together each time I have to use the toilet. My butt is so sore from going onto that toilet seat and shooting out poo. I'm, I'm having the worst time.